And hello my brave knights, princesses, and princesses, and welcome to Closer to the Sun. This is a adventure horror game. And no, before we get in, it is not Bioshock. There is a big difference between this game and Bioshock, but the steampunk is appreciated. Now, I've been told that this game is dark in a sense that there, that there is lighting, but there's not a lot of it. So once we get in, we will increase the like, the brightness. But when I, I've watched a bit of this game, and I decided, you know what? We're going to play this. Because why not? Maybe, I don't know if there actually is a brightness thing. Is it... No. Oh, that's just it. Okay, good. So we're just gonna turn that all the way up because... Okay, so we're gonna play a new game. Yes. Each chapter has its own themed collectible. See if you can find them all to learn more about the Helios and the people aboard it. So basically, what this game is about is basically your sister, Nikola Tesla, an inventor and entrepreneur and the richest man alive. His company, Arden Cliff, provides wireless electricity from stations all over the globe. When manipulated in time to extract electricity, exotic energy is formed. Research into it has proven elusive as it refers to interact with anything as if it isn't really there. Yeah, so Rosa basically went there. That's the sister. And this and I'm just gonna let the game tell you the rest. My dear sister. I left you suddenly and without warning. For that and so much more to come, I apologize. I didn't board the Helios knowing what would happen, only that pursuing my research could change the world. And we did! Just not in the way I'd imagined. Not yet, anyway. I want to explain everything now, so that you'd see that there is nothing to fear. You've always tried to protect me, my big sister, but this was meant to be. It's now my turn to protect you, if only so that things unfold the way they are meant to. Time and necessity has kept us apart, but that is about to change. We need you here aboard the Helios with me. I've enclosed a receiver, and as the name implies, it can receive signals through which we will communicate. I know little of this will make any sense right now, but I also know that you will keep your promise. I love you. Your sister, Ada. Pretty light on details there, Ada. You leave without warning, and now need me aboard the Helios? What aren't you telling me? Hmm. Okay, one moment. Okay, this is not gonna do. Hold on. This game is made in the Unreal Engine, and as you all know, I love Unreal Engine games. Look on board. Yep, that's the Helios. A gigantic. You and me both. 
British Navy in pursuit of the Helios, alleged kidnapping of prominent British mathematician has the world on edge. Hand him over, says the Prime Minister. Where do Cliff delays, de delays, denies wrongdoing? He claims that Maxwell will join voluntarily, an international group of diplomats rarely to calm rising tensions. Now, the only reason everything looks kind of ridiculous is because of the fact that Unreal Engine is a... You know what, let's just see if I can do this. Hold on. No, oh, it's raining. Because I explore. He lives Grand Thea, the best entertainment to stimulate the best minds. Yeah, I know, we went, just went around in a big circle, but I'm exploring because that's what I do. So there is a run function. That was cool. Now, for those of you that want like a quality gameplay, like everything is like ultra high and everything, you're not going to get that necessarily here because, <laughs> well, you'll get some quality, but you won't get the best of the best for certain games. There are games you will get the best quality for, but there will be some like this. We might get a bit of it. The Border of Hermes. Board of the Helios established communication with the uh Yeah, increasing the brightness really helped because in every other vi gameplay video I watched of this, it's dark. Like, you can hardly see anything anywhere. I thought the great Helios would be more... busy? I guess Ada didn't tell anyone I was coming. Nope, probably not.
Okay, you have to click to climb. That's the sound of our sponsors. A cow. This place is cool. The Helios. A scientific endeavor that cruises in luxury while the rest of the world is left to fend for itself. I mean, sure. Okay, so, like I said, quality is not going to be the best thing. But I basically am not playing this game on the very high settings, so now you guys are going to get the best quality, and frames are going to be something. It's going to be interesting. I just want to see how much. Okay, we are fine on memory. Okay. There's one thing I want to know, though. Can we run? Okay. Okay, we can run. Because. When I watch these other people play, they're used to just walking, walking, walking. There is a run function, guys. You can run. There also may or may not be a jump function. Can we climb this? No, I can. Authorized personnel only. I'm authorized. So yeah, I am sorry about the um There's a person over there. Hold on a moment. Anyway, let's get moving here. Seriously, it looks like it's like I'll have to let myself in. Oh wait, what's this? It's a piece of paper about the shipwreck, which is an active spy, isolate and eliminate. <laughs> yeah. I know you're over there. Like if you're if you're not like me and you just are want you're just going towards this door, you won't notice that guy until the music hits and then you turn and look around wildly. Warden Cliff, a company distributing electricity to half of the world and yet still hungers for that other half. So we are here, and this ship is <laughs> a Titanic. Only it isn't sinking, or is it? Quarantine? What have you got yourself into, Ada? Ah, the doors are closed now. We are officially stuck in here. Is anyone gonna welcome me with flowers and cake? Someone fell and died horribly.
Yep, this place looks like people were either trying to leave or didn't make it. It's a passport for Nicholas Ford, who was, was born on October 11th, 1850. He's an actor. His length of, length of visit is 21 days. I gotta say, the animations are great. English! Do you speak it? Do not mention it's been mathematically proven find out what else is hidden. Build the future. Work in the most advanced laboratories. Exploring new frontiers of science! Get your season ticket to the Helios Grand Theater. Join him. Assert your dominance. Well, this door isn't working. Someone call the electrician. Hello, I have ticket. Can I come in? Okay, I need, I need to let myself in. Also, paint. But elevator not working. Elevator not worthy. Hello. Hello. Any anyone there? Nope. Turns off and leaves. Now this game is supposed to be something of a survival horror, but. I'll be honest, from what I saw so far, what I've seen of this game when I watched people play some of it, it's. It says out of order. Use ladies' room. Yeah, no. We're not, we're not imposing upon them. What kind of monsters are we? This is 142, which is a storage room. Let me in. Huh, he looks like he's evil now. Because people love to do that in their spare time. It's a perfect office. And nobody's home. I guess so. Uh, yep. Our callousness is Edison's secret weapon. Lucips could sink our ship. Paranoia. That's all this is screaming. Wow. So these are all the spy reports. Well, they're all over the place. Of the back then known world. June Hawan Choi, 13th of April, 1843. Korean. He's a lab researcher. It's like the visit is indefinite.
Yeah, this brightness thing really helped in the long and it just has an agent to investigate it. So da 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 we've already read this. Okay. Just a copy of it. Confirmed Edison agents? Seems like their rivalry is alive and well. Yeah. Looks like the paranoia is alive and well. According to procedure, protocol A12 officers greeted the shuttle from Sydney upon arrival. When the guest did not appear as instructed, the officers embarked the shuttle to perform a standard search. The guest was not found aboard, and neither was any of the issued white cliff pipe work or issued clothing. Further the inspection of the vessel revealed a noticeable Bahamas indentation on the starboard side of the shuttle. There was no record of this dent or in the vessel left Sydney, so it's possible that the shuttle was boarded by the ship while en route to the Helios. This is the 11th incident of similar nature this year alone. The vulnerable nature of our automatic shuttles has to be corrected. The ID documentation and what then Cliff informs that our regular laws could provide editing with enough information to create convincing forgeries. I have yet to receive any reassurance that measures being taken to prevent these incidents from reoccurring. Officer D. Rosie. Or Die Rosie. Or De Rosie. Wait, De Rosie. No. Carter Secrets and Will Guard You. That looks like... That looks like the guy from O. Papers, please. Ananya Patel, May 28th, 1855, India, Bombay, lab technician, definite. Armless, suspected sleeper agent. Find confirming or eliminating evidence. Well, I mean, how harmless can he be? He's. I mean. How harmful can he be? He's armless. Okay. One more to go. He's ar harmlessly armless. His name is armless. Like. What more evidence do you need? Unless armless means he can armlessly take your stuff without using his arms. In which I'm thinking too hard about this. Excuse me, as Scanji private office. I was just trying to, you know, see if anyone was alive. I'm leaving. What you see, what you he do here when you leave here is it let it stay here. I thought it said it is to stay here.
Uh huh. French climatologist Jean Villeprouque's same boarding shuttle vessel to the Helios. Yeah, another high profile scientist joins the ever growing Helios crew. So this attempt averted as Helios shuttle avoids ramming. Why is it ramming? And how is that a sabotage event? If the thing is, you know, robotically controlled, it's not sabotage. It should be called an accident. Vapor. Queen Threat, no aliases, Messiah Ellis, Simon Adler, Ernest Hempson. Ernest P. Whirl. That should do it. Now to find Ada. Don't worry, her research holds the key to everything. Cryptic. Who was this message for? That is an excellent question. Okay, that's where we put it. David Bishop, 4th of December, 1890, England, London, Cop Company Minor. So he, a kid is on this place too, I wonder why. Tesla's death ray to make war impossible. Nik Nikola Tesla proposes to compel, compel the world towards peace with the threat of an immeasurable damage. His newly announced weaponry is about to go up for action. As nations all over the world scrambling for funds, Tesla's ship mounted weaponry could annihilate an entire fleet. Yeah, how about new? Well, the, uh, what's this? Interrogation room opened. This is for Sylvia Bishop. She is an art expeditionist. Uh. And bugs are crawling out of a mug. InfoSec just sent a tube that corroborates the dates and places using Edison's bio, right? Your gut instincts were right. Again. It's important that we make this one count. We need to trap him on all that he knows, rather, whether he wants to sing or not. This is definitely a West West switch info for you to get creative. Nikola Tesla recruits British intelligence officer to oversee. Information security aboard the Helios, yet another high profile scientist joins the ever growing Helios group. And again, a sabotage attempt verted as Helios shuttle avoids ramming. What is with these Helios shuttles crashing? Or almost crashing.
so this is how suspected Edison spies get interrogated aboard the Helios? Ugh. Wait until my editor hears about this. <laughs> Before sterilizer duels. Ah ha. Ah ha ha. Ugh, that lag spike. an elevator car. Duh. Ah! What the hell? Hey! Hey! Shit! Prometheus. <laughs> We're dusting ourselves off. For the Helios to find Ada. We are now at the Tessatorium. Plant. It's fake. That is cool. Right here. That that doesn't make any sense. I didn't write you any letter, Rose. But but never mind. There's been an accident or sabotage. It, it doesn't matter. We need to get off this ship. That's what the quarantine is about. Ada, what the hell is going on? Rose, listen very carefully. We really need to leave. It's spreading all. Ada. Ada. Maybe also room service. Oh, I guess I'll let myself in. Or not. Let's see, there are two ways to go. I'm going this way. Evolution. Evil Lucian. Peaceful and neutral, unbound, unattached, uncommitted to the nation states of the world, and the Helis sails on their, its own banner. You know what this all sounds like? Oh, 
Wow. This sounds like a very, very familiar rapture. Electric magnetic motor. That is cool. I'll give it to the man, he's got some pretty cool stuff. What sort of nut job builds a museum to themselves in their own house? One who is very narcissistic. Okay, so we were on one of these, these automatic ships. That have so much problems and also this frames. Ugh. Radio waves aren't just great for transmitting sound, images, and the energy across large distances, but with this radio-controlled boat, they can also be used to transport people. If you are here on the Helios, then you've already enjoyed a voyage on one of these. They are unmanned vessels, controlled automatically via radio signals. Less risky in case of malfunction and subsequent drowning. Not that there was ever much risk. I mean... That is to say, you're safely here, aren't you? So, all's well. I mean, sure. Here's what everyone's interested in. <laughs> oh, the ride the earthquake machine. Come on, game, you can do it. Ah. Going over here to this Tesla Tower. My first Tesla Tower at Warden Cliff was a huge success. I always knew that my dream of free energy transmitted wirelessly across the globe would be a resounding success. What I did not foresee was the hunger of the human race. It's gluttony for more, more, and more electricity. Wireless transmission of power, and that's the easy part. Finding that power in the first place, now there's the tricky bit. I mean, there's only one problem with things being free. Nothing is ever free. It's a neon light. And here's our Tesla coil. Oh, my dear Ada, everything could go wrong. Sea Rapture. What the? Uh... Hello? Anyone? Everyone's wearing a mask. I tell you all it. What the hell was that? Well, that guy got there. Rose, are you there? Can you hear me? 
Yeah, I can hear you, but what the hell am I doing here? If you didn't write the letter, who did? It's in your handwriting and everything. This is gonna sound weird, but it might have been me. Not present me, but future me. I know how crazy that sounds, but I promise I can explain everything. Let's rendezvous in my apartment. From there, we'll escape together, okay? Escape from what, exactly? It's not safe here, Rose. It's spreading throughout the ship. I'll tell you everything when we meet up in the You need to grab a Faraday keycard from the check-in desk there JP in the Morgan. Hall. They're kept in a wall-mounted safe. The combination should be written down somewhere nearby. The keycard will automatically take the elevator to the right district. Did you get all that? Yeah. Open safe. Mary Curry. Use elevator. Meet in your apartment. I, I got it. Great. I won't be able to reach you on the radio for a bit, so just get there and stay safe, okay? Fine. But when you get there, I'm expecting some answers. Deal? Deal. Oh, and sis? Even if I can't explain why or how you got here, really am grateful that you're here. See you soon. See you soon, sis. Okay. Tech Lobs and Nominee Mask. No physics and nominee mask. What is with these masks being so eerie? Other tech and nominee mask. So all these masks have, you know. Place people, I mean, types of sciences, I guess. Ship security. Didn't they have masks? Oh man. <laughs> they had masks in Rapture too. When the item broke out, they would wear masks. Also, this guy's in a very uncomfortable position. When Undercliff announces success, Renness wants to that other dimension. When Tessa knows how it works, Donna Free Energy is Tessa violating the law of conservation of energy. Free energy threatens thousands of energy jobs where it's expected. Now, the reason why I, I jotted down the quality is because I keep getting slack spikes because it's driving me crazy. Eric, remember to write down the new safe code when you change it. Margaret had come away from tech labs. Just reset the safe mechanism last week. She wasn't pleased. Don't mess it up again. One four two. Thanks for writing that. Huh. 
This is the key. key card for the elevator. Okay. Oh, it's jam. Why would we be scared of jam? It's delicious. We're in the main hall now. Boof. What if I want to take the stairs? I want my cardio. Also... I was wondering why it sounded like someone was hanging about. Right, let's get out of here. Somebody left jam handprints. All right. Hope this works. Oh, a totally work. Build a future on building an appetite. The home of Hestia. Once there's one to say Hesia. Or Hesha. Ugh. What is that smell? Okay. Well, that said, we will be back. Leave a like and subscribe because there's always room for more Ceilings video. Goodbye, everyone.